We're on. All right. This is a video in remembrance of Mima. And Curtis wants to get in there too. <laughs> <laughs> and basically, what we a good memory we have of Mima. And you know, you know, one thing I want to say is that she was a protector of animals. This is was her place, and this is what she loved to do the most is have her horses and dogs and cats and protect them. And this is what she wanted. And this is what she got. She loved it. And it, anything that if she thought of anybody doing anything mean about animals, she'd make sure that she told them about it. She'd be very opinionated. But that's what I remember of her. That's a good, yeah, you know, good parts. And she had, she took care of, made sure she took care of all the animals. And I'm trying to do that. You're doing a good job. <laughs> <laughs> I miss our mother-daughter talks and riding horses together when she used to be able to walk. Ball. And then I miss our Bloody Mary time together. That was her favorite drink and my favorite drink. <laughs> yeah, until you switch to wine. Well, I hate wine. <laughs> I love wine. Okay, Maya, you want to say anything? Jonah, you want to say anything? <laughs> what do y'all think about Mima? Do you miss her? Yes, but I know she yelled at us a lot. Aww. That's because she was in a lot of pain, too. Unfortunately. Yeah. But now she's not in a lot yeah, of pain. I remember, I remember she's up in heaven. having a camera running through the marsh. <laughs> On you her should, birthday. Cameron, yes. yep. you should have ran to the marsh with no horse. <laughs> Put the tail back on. I can't start. It might be. So. <laughs> this is us in the raw. Cameron, you should have, um, you should have, um, ride the, your Julianne Caramello through the marsh instead. No, yeah. they would have got stuck. <laughs> yeah, my, and there's also oyster bits at the bottom of the marsh. Luckily, nice. Cameron was running through the marsh with the shoes on. All right. All I need to say. My, your turn.